Laurie, a one 0 defeat to come on and out the cup. Your thoughts on the, the game? Well, we're really disappointed because we're out the cup, as you say, and we, you know, we worked really hard all week. We've been looking forward to the game. We, you know, we knew it was going to be a stiff test. Kilmarnock are, you know, very good side, well organised, you know, sharp, physical, but more importantly, they've got lots of quality as well. Um, so we'd prepared for it. We'd been looking forward to it, um, and we really, you know, wanted the players to give it absolutely everything to to be in the hat for the next round. So at the moment, we're disappointed with that. We gave a, a really good account of ourselves. We're disappointed to go in one down at the break, particularly the time we lost the goal. Yeah, yeah, really disappointing. You know, we we uh, we felt we built our way into the first half. We weathered a bit of an early storm, a couple of cracking uh, saves from Callum Ferry, and um, you know they showed their quality at times. Um, and we kind of built into the half, and we we you know a minute before half time, we're thinking we're in a good position, and this is uh, it's game on second half. So you know to lose the avoidable set play in the first place, you know, any set play that's that's uh, you know uh, given away is a threat and then obviously to, to lose the header and, and concede the goal was just a, a double blow for the boys and we had to lift them, we had to lift them at half time and we, we did that, I think we came out second half and showed that we were determined to, to make a, a cup tie of it and, and take the game to Killy um, and you know we had one or two chances second half that are just not falling the right side for us at the moment but uh, the determination, the application of the players I was absolutely delighted with and you know proud of them the way we played. Callum Ferry was certainly a busy man between the sticks. Your thoughts on his performance? Yeah, Cal's doing fine. He's in a run of games at the moment and uh, he made some key saves first half um, and came and took a good good corner second half as well. So Cal's growing and developing all the time as well as all all the players are. Um, and that's that's a big thing we spoke about after the game is taking all the you know good components from, from recent games and building and growing on it and uh, working on eliminating the mistakes and uh, you know we need to we'll turn this and, and, and get flying again. And Jake Davidson, you, you brought him back into the start of his first start in a number of months. How do you feel he done? I thought he did well. I think it's a, it's a difficult task for, for Jake to come in um, and play 90 minutes after so long out. Um, it's difficult to get guaranteed match fitness into players at the moment because of the lack of reserve games and uh, the difficulties with those um, due to the, the restrictions. But So it's it's you know testament to, to Sam Harrison and, and you and behind the scenes getting the boys fit and, and making sure that they're they are as match ready as we can have them. And, you know, Jake tired, as did a few that have played uh, every game this season. So uh, I thought he played well and I thought he was committed to the, the task um, and uh, it was great to see him back on the pitch. We went down to ten men late on in the game. Did you have you had much of a view of the, the red card that have you saw back? I've not. It's in the far corner, obviously, you know, tackle from Michael and he's he's in the dressing room devastated at that. You know, he'll miss a game and that's really unfortunate. Uh, but we'll accept the referee's decision and move on. Thanks, Laurie. Thank you.